Good. Hi, Peyton. How's it going? Hi, it's going well. How are you? I'm great. Well, I am so excited. Obviously, I was a huge fan of Andy Mack, and I'm so excited about your new show. Um, I mean, first and foremost, what drew you to, to this character of Lahella, and why were you looking for something like this to sort of tackle now? Yeah, I mean, I think the thing that originally drew me to the project and to the character Lahela um, is her leading this double life. Um, obviously, I don't know what it's like to be a doctor, but as an actor and working professionally at such a young age, I do know what it's like to sort of feel like a fish out of water and um, deal with what it is to be growing up um, in an adult's world, you know, and, and those adult responsibilities and the pressures um, and navigating that while also navigating a normal teenage experience. Um, and so I think Courtney approaches tackling that duality um, from a perspective that felt very truthful to my experience. Um, and I just very immediately connected with the material and really wanted to be a part of the show. Uh, and your character works alongside her mom at the hospital. I had my mother as a teacher. I know how sort of that dynamic works. Uh, how, you know, when you're this, you know, the superior factor in terms of, you know, who's in charge and whatnot. What is LaHella's relationship like with her mom? Yeah. I mean, I think that was a part of the show that I was so eager to tackle um, because I think it's, it's written so well and Kathleen brings it to life so beautifully um, is that, that again, that juxtaposition between being mother daughter and being coworkers mm -hmm. um, and sort of, where they draw that line between church and state, you know, or for them it's home and hospital. Um, and so sort of seeing them collide and clash and pull away from one another. Um, I, I mean, there's just, there are so many layers to their relationship, but it's all built on a foundation of love and respect for one another. And so because of that strong foundation, um, they always find their way back to each other. And I think, it, I mean, I do think it's a very um, fun and dynamic relationship that they have. Totally. And, you know, when obviously, you know, I don't, I don't know any 16 year old doctors, but you know, that is a, that is a lot of pressure just on its own. Is there any part of Lahela that at some point when, you know, she's dealing with like regular teen stuff, but also is still a doctor that she's like, maybe I should just like quit, you know, maybe I should just like take a break. Yeah. I mean, I don't want to give anything away, <laughs> but I definitely think um, throughout the this the season you will sort of see her question the life that she's chosen for herself and I think that's very natural I think everyone does that no matter what path you choose in life there will always be moments where you wonder what would my life look like if I had done something else you know and so I definitely think that's something that she sort of battles and deals with absolutely and I feel like that's such a real thing you know not just for like teens but like very much like young adult, like people in their twenties make that decision all the time. Um, oh, definitely. Way there's yeah. all the time. Um, what is her relationship like with her siblings? Because that's an interesting dynamic when one is like the prodigy and there's a lot of attention there. Well, how does she sort of like balance her siblings too? Yeah, um, I think the family dynamic was something that was really fun to explore with, you know, the rest of my cast, um, because we have such a fun dynamic off screen that was very sort of immediate. We had this chemistry and this camaraderie, and I think that really translates on screen. Um, but I think it, one, one thing that was fun was Courtney and I, the creator of our show, um, very much bonded over the human experience of being a middle child and the dynamics that occur being in the middle right and and sort of the fight for attention and for recognition because you know in, in a typical household or in our experience it was the oldest one is sort of the 
the star child, the golden child. And then the youngest one is sort of the baby that can do no wrong and sort of being caught in the middle of that. And so I think a really fun dynamic is that even though she's this teenage doctor that's saving lives, she feels that she gets the least recognition in her household and anything her brothers do is, is this incredible thing that their parents are so excited about and everything she does is like, Oh yeah, that's just what Lahela does. And um, so getting to dive into that um, relationship with their birth order and um, how that affects their um, family dynamic was, was really fun to um, totally. sort of focus in on. Yeah, I'm the oldest, but my sister has echoed a lot of your sentiments um, <laughs> and many, many times. <laughs> okay. Um, but yes, I am. I love the first episode and I am so excited to see uh, where the show goes from here. It was just, it was, you know, had the comedy elements, the drama elements. It was, it was perfect. Um, so congratulations on this new role and hopefully we can chat again soon. Thank you so much. Yeah, definitely. Yeah.